And so I am going to now introduce to you Jeff Bell, who I feel has got vision and insight. He's going to probably tell you a little bit about his background, but he's very media savvy, and I think he's got a way that he can connect with this new generation of voters out there that are willing to vote for people rather than politics so much. They're not so much locked into you're this, you're that. They want to focus on the future and their future, and they proved the fact this last general election. And I think uh, Jeff can harness that energy in a way that uh, some of the old attitudes uh, cannot harness. So with that, I'm going to introduce you to Jeff Bell, State Department. <laughs>
because I've been working in advertising, marketing, and campaign strategy, and messaging strategy, and product strategy for the last 20 years since I had my first job in advertising when I was 16 years old, is learning to get the message to who it needs to go to. In the past, the parties operated on a direct mail. We send mail. How often do you guys get a piece of direct mail that goes from the mailbox straight to the trash? You know, Mitt Romney sends me direct mail. <laughs> Dear Utah Republican, it says. So, you know, I mean, it's just, it is a gigantic chunk of money. The part he's talking about now is investing in an email system to where they can do targeted zip code email, but the cost is so prohibitive that if they do that, they won't be able to, to move around and do anything else, considering we don't have, you know, a presidential fundraising year for the party. Now, this technology that they're going to use for that actually exists open source, and with five programmer volunteer hours, we could build the same program for about 100 bucks. But there's nobody there right now that knows how to massage and use the more modern technology. Now, they've talked a lot about how we, we ran some TV ads, we ran a radio ad. All of that's fine. Did you, how many people heard the radio ad up here? Did you hear it on the internet or did you hear it on the radio? Radio? Okay, so that's one, two, three. How many of you guys said? Oh, it wasn't. Most of you didn't. Guys, when we get up into the into the more you know rural areas, the smaller population, the internet targeting very important because we can do that. Targeting internet saturation is really good up here. But aside from that, you have you have a local paper, yes. You have a couple of local radio stations. <laughs> <laughs> you can call it. <laughs> but still, you have a better chance of your ad, if you do a print ad, being seen in a small town local paper than you do when an ad goes into the trip or the Desert News, especially in your area. More people read their local rags than they do the two big city papers. You know, here you're in, what, 20, 30 pages? There you're in a couple of hundred pages. You get a one-day run on a print ad. Internet ads, you can push, you can forward. Radio ads, you can run over and over and over again, especially in the smaller stations outside of the metropolitan area for a low, low cost. And the one thing that I do that the party doesn't do, this is what I do for a living. I build television. I do documentary features. I do commercials. I do targeted marketing. I build radio and audio. I build internet campaigns. It's what I do. It's my skill set. My proposal is, when you're all, you know, elected, is to put our own, basically, television, radio, print graphics, web graphics, studio, as part of the state party function. We put together packaging and certain templating in several different designs, forms, what you like. When a candidate decides to run, or run again, they come down and spend a couple of hours, you know, with me, with some kids from the University of Utah. I'll talk about them in a second. We sit down with them and we build them an entire campaign package. Lawn signs, logos, stationery, t-shirt designs so that Steve can print them. You know, all of these things, and it can be done in a small amount of time without having to pay the professional graphic artist hundreds or thousands of dollars to get it done. You get your package, you work with the state party, off it goes. You're ready to do that.